Hey, good morning, y'all. Um, I don't know how great this quality is going to be because I don't have my ring light on currently. But it's okay, I'll have some better lighting a little later in the video. Today, I am going to walk you guys through, um, I was going to say my morning routine, but today is probably just going to be another day in the life of being an entrepreneur. So I just woke up, I went ahead and filled up my water bottle, I just took my vitamins. So I'm going to get dressed and then we're going to move on the very first task of the day and I'm going to talk a little bit about my business and the holiday season and such. Alright you guys, I'm back and we do have some light now today. I'm going to go ahead and get started with sending out an email. Um, usually I like to schedule my emails ahead of time, but this is literally something that just kind of happened on the spot. So I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to draft up the email and then I'm going to send it to every single one of my customers. Um, so what's happening is I'm actually going to be shutting down my website for the rest of December and then I'm going to open it back up on January 1st, 2022. So the reason I'll be shutting down my website is because I'm kind of doing like a rebranding, but I'm also going to be launching an exclusive bonnet. Um, and I say exclusive because it's like limited supply. Um, and I'll be launching that in January. And then I will also be having a spring launch of a brand new product. So if you follow me on Instagram, you already knew about this new product launch because I actually asked for um, my potential customers and um, my Coily community members input on it, um, what they thought I, the name of the new product should be um, and when we should launch it. So they do know the season that I'm launching it in, but I haven't released um, the month or the day, um, but I do have a month and a day already set. I'm just not going to put it out there yet. Um, I'll put it out there in due time. I'm going through a rebranding basically, so that's why I want to shut down the website. Um, and even if you were to go on my website right now, you could already see that I'm starting to make like small changes on my homepage. And of course, at the heading, um, I announced that, hey, the website's going to be closed for about two or three weeks. Um, the rest of December will be back open um, January 1st, 2022. So what I need to do is I need to send out an email let my customers know and I'm actually pretty late because this was um, again a steady fast decision I decided that I was just going to completely shut down my website so I can actually like take the time and critique things and get them looking the way that I want them to look while my website is shut down of course I will be um, changing things around on my website oh and I also have a new collection that's coming up um, and so all of this is going to be in the email which is why I say it's always important to be subscribed to our email. Also really quick, I just wanted to mention that if you are not following the brand at Coily For You on TikTok, girl, you are missing out. You, you're, you're just missing out at this point. Uh, so I'm posting three times a week and I'm probably gonna bump that up to four times a week now. So I did a pretty good job. I reached my goal. I posted three times last week, but I am going to bump it up to four times just because um, consistency is always key with everything that you do. I'm also going to be um, bumping up the kind of content that I post on my Instagram page as well. So if you are not following us on Instagram at Coily for you, again, you are missing out, girl. Go ahead and click the links in the description box. They will lead you to my TikTok as well as my Instagram page for the brand. And 2022 is going to be so exciting for my brand. Um, I already have so many different ideas. I'm literally putting everything into place and again me shutting down my website just honestly gives me time to really work on the website, work on the new product, work on the t new collection as well as build my audiences on TikTok as well as on Instagram and really just getting deep down into connecting with my audience and connecting with the problems that they have so I can figure out what I can do in order to help them solve the problems that they have. <laughs> But let me go ahead and log into my computer so I can start working on this email. Ugh, and honestly, it's not even going to be a super long email. It's probably going to be very vague, um, very straight to the point, very short. Usually I like to make my emails um, long, sweet. Um, also, I haven't sent out an email at all during the month of December. I think it's been like um, pretty much three or four weeks since I sent out my last email. So I think they will be surprised to even hear from me. I know they've probably been wondering, where's Brianna? Where's Brianna? Where is Brianna? I've, I've been a no-show, you guys, because it's just been so busy between personal stuff, between business, 
between work it, it's just it's so much going on but i'm so excited i'm so blessed and god has been working in me oh y'all i'm so excited but anyway go follow the links i'm gonna go ahead and draft up this email i'm gonna send it out um so my customers can know what's up and i will get back with y'all in the next half all right y'all so it's 9 37 not even 10 o'clock yet um and I need to moisturize my hair because I literally had um, put some gel on the top of my head and I rocked a low ponytail for about four days. So my hair is dry. So I just sprayed some regular water on my hair. I'm using this Argan Oil 4-in-1 Leave-In Conditioner um, because my hair needs it badly. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do braids or um, flat twists in the front yet, but I definitely need to moisturize the back. Um, so currently it's not even 10 o'clock and I feel super accomplished. So after I went ahead and sent out my email, I did created some Instagram posts that will go out this week on my page. I also um, filmed and uploaded a brand new TikTok, so that is up. You guys can go check those both out. Again, the links for both my um, Instagram and my TikTok business page will be linked below. I'm just kind of making sure that my hair is getting that moisture that it needs. So yeah, it's not even 10 o'clock yet and I genuinely have done so much already. I feel like a lot of the stuff that I do as a business owner, I can't really film and do at the same time because I film with my phone and a lot of my like Instagram planning I do on my phone. I record TikToks on my phone um, and I just do of course a lot of things on my phone so it was really hard to kind of get some of that small stuff which is why a camera would really really come in handy but it's fine I'm not going to worry about it too much. My hair oil that I sell okay okay um, it's called the Hair and Scalp Moisture Sealant Oil. So that is currently what I'm using to seal in the leave-in conditioner in the water that I just put on my hair. Just making sure that I'm really, and look at, look at how shiny my hands are, y'all. Like, you know this oil is biz -um. Just making sure that my hair is moisturized and it keeps that moisture because I won't be washing my hair until Friday which is five days from now. So I'm going to re-moisturize my hair during the week, of course, because it's winter and my hair does get pretty dry. So, you know, I do end up moisturizing about two or three times a week, depending on the hairstyle. But because my hair is, of course, out and it's not in mini twists or a protective style or anything like that, I am going to need to re-moisturize my hair at least two times this week before I head into my wash day. Okay, so the back part of my hair is all moisturized. I'm just going to show you all the back just so y'all can get a good glimpse. And I'm just going to go ahead and put this in to a regular ponytail. So I have my ponytail holder and I'm just going to pull all of my hair back. And I don't want to irritate my hair, so I'm only wrapping the ponytail holder around one time. Moisturize these two front parts, and then I'm going to clip them to the back, and that's going to be that.
All right, and this is how the other side came out. Um, actually, not too bad, but as you guys can see, I definitely am dominant with my right hand because this is very crisp. This is a uh, no, a little frizzy, but I can work. I can work with it. It's fine. It's fine. It's all good. And just wrap that around in the back. And I'm gonna use a bobby pin. I'm actually gonna use two of them just to make sure that. It is extra secure. Fluff her out a little bit as much as I possibly can. Now the next thing that I need to do in terms of business is I actually went ahead and I'm getting ready to make a reel. So this reel is of course going to be a post for my Instagram and I went ahead and made a actual script for it. So when I don't have like trending audio sounds, every once in a while I will do a scripted out reel and this is actually going to be very informative so I'm actually excited about that. I've only ever done a scripted reel one other time and it actually did fairly well, way better than I thought it would do um, for my Instagram page. So I'm actually very excited to upload it. Um, this reel will be going up on Wednesday. So if you follow me, you already know what to expect. Again, if you're not following me at Queerly For You, go ahead and check out the page link down below. And I'm going to go ahead and get into it and I will check back with y'all. So I am currently back in my bed space. So I just finished filming my reel that is going up on Wednesday. I only have about one more feed post to, um, make and then i have all of my posts already completed and planned out for wednesday um but before i go ahead and do my last one i'm gonna go ahead and watch a replay of a live um and it basically has to do what with getting website clicks and all of that and typically when i rewatch lives i like to watch them on my laptop just because it's a bigger screen than um my phone is and i can actually concentrate better and i of course like to write down notes and all of that good stuff so i'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna do that and typically these um replays of lives that i watch are usually about an hour and a half two hours long but this one is actually i think only like 45 minutes to about an hour so this is this one is a bit shorter so i'm like okay i'm gonna go ahead and knock this out get a little bit of knowledge i'm going to knock out my last feed post that i need to make for wednesday and then i am going to go ahead and work on some editing for my website as well um i probably won't show you guys that process um or i might i don't know i haven't really decided yet but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and get into this and let you watch your girl work so I'm going to go ahead and go to my browser and log into my Instagram, which is kind of already automatic. I just had to wait for it to load, which is really nice. I mostly have all of my Google accounts synced to my laptop from my phone, so that's pretty dope. Here on my Instagram page, and now what you guys are seeing me do is I'm actually going to my save posts. So these are all of my save posts that I have, and I have a bunch of save posts for multiple different reasons, but now I am just scrolling down until I actually can find the live, and I love watching replays of um, marketing lives because I can always go back and take notes, and of course that's what I'm doing today right here right now, so I'm still scrolling, trying to look for the live, which will be coming up soon, and there it is and boom it pops right up on my screen and i'm going to get straight into it um and just a little quick note before i get started um i'm not going to make you guys watch the whole live with me because that honestly would be pointless but i did want to put in there that um this live is about i think it's about four or five different tips on how i can increase traffic to my website a live that i watched a few days ago was from the same brand and it was about dropping out of college and quitting your job and becoming a CEO full time. Um, and I usually love um, the, the brand that I always go to and who I have learned so much from is called Girlpreneur Essentials. If you are a business owner and you're not following her on Instagram, um, if you are you haven't participated or invested in any of her courses, you're honestly sleeping. She has taught me everything that I know. Um, she goes live quite frequent, frequently with so many experts. Another live that I watched of hers, which was about a week ago, was on how you can actually um, team up with retailers, so like Walmart, Target, Sephora, um, 
just all these different retailers and actually get your products in their stores. So she's legit. She has a bunch of different experts. Um, they always collab together. She has amazing resources on a bunch of different stuff, but I won't bore you guys with all of that. Definitely, if you're a business owner, you need to go follow Girlpreneur Essentials on Instagram. I will leave her link to her um, Instagram page down below, so make sure to go check that out as well. But I'm going to go ahead and get started on this, and I will check back in with y'all. It's probably been about an hour and a half, two hours since I last was on camera, so I just did finish watching my live. The live, again, was only an hour. Um, I did end up doing a couple of other things. Let me show y'all the notes that I got from this live. Okay, so this live, honestly, like, God is working in my life. Like, my mental state, my soul, my, just literally everything, physically, emotionally, my well-being, um, especially when it comes to my mental health and my mindset. Like, God is really just putting me, he's putting my brand, he's putting my vision out like he's just putting me out there and he's giving me all the gems that I need to do it. It now it's just up to me to really put in the work. I got two or like a page and a half basically from this live. And again, I don't think I told you guys what the live was about. Basically the live was how I can get more traffic to my website with um I won't bore you guys with all the details because you probably really don't care. But I did get this full page of notes and then this is the back. When I say I watched this live just in time, I literally mean I watched it just in time because my I will be rebranding my website and literally like redoing it. Um, I'm actually going to shut it down tomorrow, like I mentioned earlier in the video when I was talking about my brand and rebranding and all that. So I'm going to be redesigning my website and I have actually already um, started making switches in terms of my, not really my brand colors but tweaking just like small stuff but now I can really get into it because I did just watch that live so honestly it just had to do with how I can get more traffic to my website and now I can finish out the month and really focus on designing my website with a clear head, knowing what I need to do, knowing what's going to be helpful, and actually having free resourceful tools on how I can successfully do it. So I'm just like, uh, I'm just so blessed and I'm so excited, y'all. Like, I'm so, so excited for my rebranding of my website. Like, I'm, I can't tell y'all how excited I am. Like, it's just, I'm just so excited, like period 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 so the next thing i'm gonna do is i'm actually gonna walk around a little bit stretch a little bit uh, maybe listen to music for maybe about 10 minutes or so clear my mind a little bit sometimes it's hard to stay focused when i'm working the whole day straight so it's very helpful for me to free my mind and just listen to music, chill out, not really having to focus on anything for a couple of minutes, especially after sitting down and intaking information for pretty much an hour. My brain kind of needs that, not reset button, but just, you know, a moment to be calm and to be settled. Um, and after the 10 minutes of relaxation, I am going to head straight into creating my last piece of content um, for Wednesday. And then I'll be all done with creating content for the day. Um, again, it's still pretty early. It's only... Um, a few minutes past two o'clock in the afternoon. So I think that's honestly like really good, especially for the amount of work and tasks that I've actually completed today. So I'm very, very hype about that. Okay, like I'm on top of my stuff. Did not come to play games. I'm back you guys. So it is officially a little after three o'clock. So it's been about an hour since I last checked in with y'all. I am feeling very productive this is the most work that i've done in one day in a very 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 long time oh my gosh also y'all 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 let me really quick before i forget let me show you this business bag that i got from every bit of bossy i bought this really cute bag it says small and then the small is crossed out and then it says big business period so this is what i will be using when i do my post office runs i do have a smaller one i'm sure you guys have seen the smaller one before i'm gonna go ahead and insert a video that i posted from my instagram or a picture or whatever it is um from a while back but i just ordered this new one and it's so cute it has her website and everything at the bottom everybitofbossy.com 
you guys probably can't see that but it's all good it's all good big business energy only and i would tell you guys to head over to my website and check it out but when i upload this video there's going to be nothing to check out <laughs> because when I, this video gets uploaded by the time i edit it and everything my website will be already shut down um but if you do happen to go check out my website there will be a short note or a message saying to join my email list so you can be notified weeks in advance before we launch our new collection our new product and when we reopen our website all of that good stuff when we have exclusive sales um bada bing bada boom all of that beautiful glorious things and trust me you are going to not want to miss when i reopen my website and I'm, I'm just really excited you guys like this entrepreneurship journey is definitely i don't want to say a mind playing game but it's not for the weak minded it's not it's just it's it's not because entrepreneurship is a lot of the time about what you can do for your business it's about research it is about putting in the work literally putting in the work and even when you put in the work you don't get the results that you want right away it's kind of a waiting game it's kind of a wait and see if this works out if it doesn't work out okay i need to move to the next thing and see what else i can do <laughs> look at my fur babies back there anyway um just a lot about mental and some people just don't mentally want to be put in a position where either they can't control something or things aren't going their way so they kind of give up again entrepreneurship being a business owner is not for everybody so you know to my business owners i applaud you um i salute you because you're going strong especially for those of us who started our business during the pandemic um crazy 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 but yeah i don't want to go on a huge spiel because this vlog is already going to be long enough but you if you made it this far into the vlog thank you so much for watching i am going to go ahead and end it here because i am going to have a crap load of editing to do but anyway thank you guys so so much for watching today's vlog i am again super excited about my website um you may go check out the website if you want to and subscribe to my email list i will make sure to put you on my email list so you know weeks in advance before our website reopens and a bunch of other cool stuff that we have going on don't forget to follow my tiktok as well as my um, instagram account all of the links will be below for you guys and thank you thank you thank you again so much for watching and i hope to catch you guys in my next video Mwah. Bye, y'all.